Hey guys, thank you for watching. I just wanted to create this look using my contour and highlight routine. Um, I haven't seen much of these videos on YouTube so I decided to just do one and show you guys how I do it and I've got a lot of requests on my contour routine. If you guys want to see how I got this look, please keep watching. So I've already done my foundation and concealer routine because I didn't want the video to be too long. I'm going to do a separate video for that. And starting off, I'm going to use Eyeshadow Compact by Cryolan in Matte Dark Brown. And I'm going to be using this number 7 brush because it gives me a super blendable look. Initially, I was pointing off those points because that's where I'm going to actually contour. That's uh, on the tops of my ears. You just have to like get on the top of your ears and that's where you should contour. And you don't want to reach like uh, until down your mouth, like uh, on the sides of your mouth. You don't want to reach there because you, your face will look like it's sagged. And I love contouring in the ends because I like a very sharp contoured look. Exactly like that. Next off, I'm going with this Clazona angled contour brush on my forehead and on the temples. Following my jawline too, just to cover up a double chin which I don't have. <laughs> I'm contouring on my forehead to give myself a, f a slimmer face. I know I'm making funny faces. <laughs> Next off, I'm just blending off the contour that I did perfectly well. I'm going in with the Yardley Feather Finish Translucent in number 26 just to clean my contour perfectly. Initially to sharpen it more. also on my nose just to give it a highlighted look. Next off I'm going with a flat shadow brush by Clazona just to get my line very straight on my nose because we don't want it going curved. So I'm going to be going on both of my sides of the nose and uh, just define it perfectly using a very straight line. And I'll also be going on the tops just to give it a little bit of dimension. That's the finished look. Next off, I'm going with this blending brush and completely blend that contour that I did on my nose. I don't want it to initially look like it's contoured, I want it to look real. Next off, I'm just going to remove the powder that I put underneath my contour just to remove the sharpness and make it perfectly blend blended. Next off, I'm going with the Cryolan Dark Brown with the same blending brush and contouring my eyes. I'm going on to my crease but I'm mostly focusing on the outer V. Next off, I'm going with a Bobbi Brown pencil brush underneath my eye. Focusing also on my outer corner only to give it a little bit of smoke, you know, like a smoky eye. <laughs> I 
I'm using this bronzer from 17 it's actually a bronzer but I don't like it I, li I don't like using it as a bronzer I use it as a highlighter and I love using it as a highlighter and using that champagne color I'm gonna be highlighting my cheekbones Using that same champagne color, I'm going to be highlighting my nose but focusing on the tops because I don't want it to look like I've actually just highlighted my whole face. And also on my cupid's bow and on my chin obviously. And then I'm going to go with this applicator which is amazing for using shimmer colors and it's going to be damp. Using the second goldenish shade on the bronzer compact, I'm going to be highlighting my brow bone. And then I'm going to quickly fill in my brows with this Style USA eyebrow pencil in the brown side. Then I'm going to take this chocolatey shade from the 17 bronzer and place it on my lids perfectly. Mainly on the lid area. Next off, I'm going to go with the lightest shade that is a very white pearly shade. I'm going to apply it on, the, on my inner tear duct. I'm going to obviously finish this look with a blush and I'm going to be using Too Faced Papa Don Peach. It's like a peachy shade. It's so beautiful. I'm going to quickly curl my lashes then the mascara I'm going to be using is by Bobbi Brown and it's the Extreme Party Mascara I'm going to use the Atmatic USA Lashes in number 005 and the lash glue I'm going to be using today is by Sweet Touch England Eyelash Azeki the lip liner I'm using is by Christine Dior, number 573, Mauve Desin Volte. I don't know, it's the Airy Mauve, I think. I mixed two lipsticks for this look. I used the Medora of London Viva Glam Matte in number 235 and Ludan May Watery Glamour Lipstick in number 10. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope uh, you guys learned something and uh, if you guys haven't subscribed already please subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!